Hey guys, welcome to my channel. Today we're working on the upstairs bathroom. Come on, let's go. Alright, we're gonna be working on refinishing the bathtub. I've already got most of it finished. Um, I got it clean. All it needs to be done is I have to apply the finish coat on it. So you can see it here. Looks real dirty. It's really old. So today what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna get the epoxy coat on. Hopefully, the first coat I'll get that on. And then I have to wait three hours, but not four hours, to put the second coat on. So, wish me luck. I got the tough tile porcelain, or tough as tile, excuse me, porcelain epoxy. And it says, when you open it, it says to mix thoroughly, but do not shake because you don't want to trap air bubbles into it. So, oh man, it's not mixed up at all. So I guess we got to mix this for a while. Get it all mixed up, man. That stuff is thick. There we go, it's starting to thin out a little bit. Stir till it becomes one solid color with no swirls in it. It says to brush it, not roll it. This is my first time doing it, so I guess you're coming along the ride with me. And I'm gonna work from the far side in so that I'm not reaching over any wet parts. I'm gonna check back in with you after I finish the first coat. All right, guys. Take my mask off so you can understand what I'm saying. I finished the first coat, so I'm gonna go ahead and put my wet brush and the paint into a plastic bag so that I can reuse it in three hours. So, I'm gonna go ahead and do that now. Brush. And we will tie it up just like that so no air can get in there. And so now you can see the first coat, how it went. Doesn't look too shabby. I mean, it looks kind of spotty because you can see through the first coat, but man, when I get that second coat on there, it's gonna look nice. All right, I'll be back in a jiff. Okay, so it's been three hours, not four per the directions. I got <clears throat> food in my belly and I'm ready to come up here and start working. So. If you can see, got the first coat on and it's relatively dry. Um, dry enough for the first coat, it's not fully cured yet. But we're going to put a second coat on, coat on right now. And uh, I'm going to go ahead and put my mask on because it is really strong. The fumes are really strong. If you, if you ever do this, make sure that you have a mask because it will kill you. Alright, I'm going to grab my brush. Epoxy. Let it get stir again. But it wasn't fully mixed again. It kind of settled a little bit. Right. I'll check back in after I get the second coat applied and show you what the finished product looks like. See ya. All right, so here's after the second coat of paint, of epoxy coat. It's really strong in here. I'm trying to be quick, but here you go. So you can see it. Look how pretty it looks. So pretty. Not bad. 
bad for a 1950s bathtub. And so now it has to sit for 72 hours, I think, before we can pull the tape and kind of mess with it. Um, so I'll see you then. Hey guys, um, we got a uh, update here on the bathroom, which we finished uh, epoxy coating the other night. So it looks great, nice and shiny. Looks like a brand new tub. I will say that this epoxy, I've worked with epoxy a lot, but this particular coat, this stuff is way stronger, way smellier than normal epoxy. I had my mask on, but it was almost gagging me through my mask. So I gotta wait another day, 72 hours, before I can peel the tape off and start adding all the fixtures and the drain back to the tub. Um, but today, what we're gonna do is we're gonna go out to the workshop and we are going to work on a slab table. So, I'll see you over there. 